some teams a little slow out of the gate, Smitty, including a couple of contenders. B.A., if you're a true contender, you're not concerned at this time. Right with the ball. Will it go? The rebound by MP. Well, we talk about the value of great rim protection. That's a shot he typically makes. And this kind of selfless textbook positioning to draw the charge. Right outside. Now Herder. Back to right. Pass to Herder. Five to shoot. There's a screen by Jang. And it's Herder penetrating. The Thunder pull it in. Coming into this, having knots to win against Boston in their last game. And I'll tell you, that was not an easy environment to play in. It was a hostile crowd on the road, but it didn't bother them at all. What was beautiful, it was a tremendous game plan coming in. You saw the execution, and you saw the results. Inside. And he was camped in the lane there. He gets a three-second call. Here's Oklahoma City now. They've gone on an 8-0 run. MP outside. No good on the triple. For Atlanta, they've gone 7 of 16 so far. Herder gets the bucket. And gives Sweet Lou credit. Turns down his own shot because his teammate has a better one. On the wing man. Here's Maladon. Looking for his first basket still in this one. On the wing man. Shoots over a Kongwu. Rejected by a Kongwu. Here's Herder. Easy jumper from very short distance. And now it's just a two-point Thunder lead. Finding makeable shots. Kevin Herder continuing to become more efficient as a scorer. A Kongwu with the rebound. Atlanta is shooting a solid 50% in the opening quarter. With Onyeka Okongwu, you get an athletic big man who puts a ton of energy into his defense. The Hawks need to get one up here. Goes up from the top of the key. Again, Atlanta. And I feel like we really see Okongwu's defensive prowess when he's going against the pick and roll. Well, his time and his instincts are terrific, B.A. Combine that with his physical attributes, and it's easy to see what makes him a special player at the defensive end. Right outside. Takes it inside. Pass to Herder. Knocks down the long J. Herder's got seven points. Oklahoma City has gone four of eight from outside in this first quarter. And stolen by Herder. And here's the fast break. Finished off the break. Now it's a five-point Atlanta lead. Yeah, credit Herder. Recognizes where the help is coming from. Finds the open man. A Kongwu with the rebound. Atlanta's gone just one of six from the three-point line so far. And it's Williams off the drive. It's rebounded by Oklahoma City. And going against Atlanta, their first meeting on the year. It's really hard to know what to expect when teams play only twice a year. Makes it a bit of a mystery. The balance between East and West, after years of being dominated by the West, is starting to even out some. Just owning the painted area. If it's working, no need to change. Williams with it. Looking at the numbers, he's putting up seven points a game. Pass to Chang. Back to Williams. Just five to shoot. Fires from 14. That shot off the mark. And it's Oklahoma City the other way. Already plus five in terms of rebound margin. 
Here's Roby. MP with it. On the wing man. Williams defending. Here's MP. Atlanta with a rebound. The Kongu's got four rebounds now. Now Williams. 24 seconds left in the first quarter of the game. Williams on the wing. And he's Oklahoma City foul. Jeremiah Robinson there. And that's his first personal foul. Two six. At the line for Atlanta, with Williams taking two shots. And Williams drops them both. Money from the strike. He does a great job night in and night out. Here's Maladon, hounded by Wright. It's tipped. And they're able to recover. And so it's Clint Capella making things happen for the Hawks. Yes. All right, let's just cut the board. Come on, get out. We're going to and thanks again for tuning in. If you're just joining us, we've played through one quarter of action so far. And from what we've seen from the Hawks, what's your take so far? Well, I'm really loving their activity. I mean, they're contesting shots. They've really set a strong tone early. And you can see it's already having an impact. It can cause shooters to think twice. Collins at the floor with Capella at center. Trey Young out there with DeLon Wright. And it's Hunter in at the three. So and that's yes, his first personal foul. First team foul. At the line, put your arms. The line right. At the line, but he also team. can find his own shot at any time. And he makes both free throws. And you can also see the diverse skill set of DeLon Wright on the defensive side of the floor. Yeah, he can come up with a lot of steals. He puts pressure on ball handlers. And he manages to pull down a lot of rebounds for a guard. Roby's shot is good. And off the jump, they were effective from deep. I don't know why they haven't continued to fire from out there. Young against Gilgis Alexander. Collins with a screen on Gilgis Alexander. Here's Young. Good on the shot. Young's got eight. Does a good job of making quick reads and quick decisions off ball screens. Young always looking under control. Oh, wasted no time on that one. They've now had assists on each of their last three buckets. The Hawks leading. Young, the pass to Hunter. And the foul called on MP. And that's his first foul. And that's his first personal foul. Donovan just checked in for the Hawks. foul when you see now one. to the lineup for the Thunder. Collins with a screen on Gilgis Alexander. Kicks it out to Collins. That three's off the mark. He had more than enough room to hit that. Just couldn't make it happen. To the left side wing. The three. Always a nice way to start. Makes his first one. In order to create effective spacing, you need enough guys on the floor that can hit from downtown. Young, the pass to Hunter. Back to Young. Four on the clock. Hey, in six attempts, he's made five. Talk about efficiency. An intimidator himself. Capella's not shying away from a little contact. To the paint. And MP gets it to go on the assist by Gilgis Alexander. Gilgis Alexander's got five assists tonight. Bogdanovich passes to Young. Outside Bogdanovich. Collins a screen. Bogdanovich finds Collins. And he didn't get quite enough under that one. Can't blame him. Just trying to take what the defense allows. Gilgis Alexander on the wing to the inside. Here's MP. Right wing. Here's the pick. On the wing, MP. Can't get the go-ahead bucket. 
it for Atlanta. They've gone two of four here in the second quarter. Pass to Capella. Now Young. Capella screen on Gilgis Alexander. Now here's Bogdanovich. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. Isaiah Rudy. And that's his first personal foul. Team third. Season program. Yeah, he had an impressive run in a number of European leagues, amassing a ton of awards and championships. So he definitely knew what he was getting into when he came stateside to play with the rest of the best. And slam dunk by Gilgis Alexander. Impressive night for Shea Gilgis Alexander, scoring and doing it in a variety of ways. Pass to Young. And here's Collins. Here's Capella. Outside Young. The three is up. And it's Kitty with a rebound. Oklahoma City has gone 5 of 10 from beyond the three-point line in this game. And slam dunk by Gilgis Alexander. The ability to alternate tempo off the bounce. This is how Gilgis Alexander keeps defenders guessing. Goes up from the block. It's blocked. And they'll get another chance. Back to Collins. Pass to Young. Now here's Collins. It's hauled in by Baisley. Baisley's got four rebounds in the game. Here's Giddy. And here's MP. Collins defending. And Collins with the big block. Excellent feel and timing. Collins does a good job of protecting the rim. And let's swing it over to the sideline and hear from Allie. Hey, Brian. The Hawks went on a tear last season after naming Nate McMillan their interim head coach. After he won Eastern Conference Coach of the Month and helped guide them to the franchise's first playoff run in four seasons, it seemed inevitable that he'd become the head coach long term. Guys? Nothing new for him, Allie. Good stuff there. Double team on Gilgis Alexander. Pass to Giddy. Down low. Here's MP. Oh, he misses the go-ahead basket. Atlanta's gone 0 for 4 from beyond the arc here in the second quarter. Young, the pass to Collins. And here's Bogdanovich. Outside Young. Collins with a screen on Gilgis Alexander. Here's Young with the drive. Misses, and the dry spell continues. I mean, he's staying aggressive, trying to regain his touch. But right now, he's hurting the team. Here's Baisley, guarded by Young. On the wing, MP. Pass to Giddy. Oklahoma City's got to hurry. they got to get up a shot. MP shot is off. And for Atlanta, they're shooting the ball at around 42% for the game. Trying to go for a lob there. Excellent defense and anticipation to stop it. Here's Gilgis Alexander. Again, no good by Oklahoma City. You expect him to make that, especially from that distance. Bogdanovich with a screen on Gilgis Alexander. Young, the pass to Collins. Six to shoot. Collins a screen. Here's Bogdanovich. Count it. Rock solid screen right there. The defender got completely lost. Hey, if you're not going to fight over, you're essentially giving the shooter the look he wants. Pass to Giddy. Young against Gilgis Alexander. MP, the pass to Gilgis Alexander. Let's the three fly. Capella with a rebound. Capella's got rebound number five here tonight. You gotta love how they've been crashing the boards, fighting hard for every miss. Collins passes to Bogdanovich. Driving to the basket. Up top, Capella. Pass to Bogdanovich. Got a piece of it. Here's Baisley. MP, a screen on Capella. Here's Giddy. And the lamp is good off the glass. 
Five points in the game. He's a go-to guy for them because he's that consistent. Time and time again, he delivers. Back to Young. Capella, screen on Gilgis Alexander. Young, the pass to Capella. And the slam dunk by Capella. Great spot. Here for Oklahoma. A little under three and a half minutes off the clock now in the third quarter. Taking a look at Oklahoma City. They've got Shea Gilgis-Alexander, Isaiah Roby out there with Darius Baisley. Then it's MP, and it's Giddy in at the two. I like that. Collins playing under control, reading the floor. Nice set up there. Here's Giddy. He's got five. Clock at six. Pass to Baisley. And again, Oklahoma City, no good. And their physical dominance has been on display. A 10 rebound advantage is a good indicator of how this game has gone. Young against Gilgis Alexander. Now here's Young. Give him eight. Out of bounds. It'll be Oklahoma City's ball. You want uns Keep it under control. The Thunder have gone three of seven here in this third quarter. On the wing, MP. And again, Oklahoma City, no good. The thing is, you want to do everything you can to help your team. And sometimes you just try to do too much. Outside Young. Misses the layup. Offensively, that's how you want to end the possession, except for the result. Here's Gilgis Alexander. Another miss. Boy, they're in a funk right now. For Atlanta, they've gotten five of seven attempts in the third quarter. And Hunter, here we go. Oh, it's stolen by Gilgis Alexander. Kicks it out to MP. Pass to Giddy. Now MP. Defended by Bogdanovich. Out to the wing. Shot clock at six. On the take. And a foul call on the wing. And that's his first. Personal foul. Two seconds. Good whistle. Collins at the four with Capella at center. DeLon Wright is out there with Trey Young. And it's Bogdanovich in at the small forward position. So that's the Hawks five. That one's wide left. I'll tell you what. We know he's been struggling tonight, but his teammates have pitched in big time. Pass to Horde. Outside Gilgis Alexander. Yo, set it up. Wiggins passes to MP. That one's MP. good for two. Inside the paint, MP plays with real heart, not allowing the defense to discourage him. Wiggins against Wright. Here's Young. Well, at the wing position, Grant, you were one of the league's best passers. Which wing players stand out to you in that category now? You know what? I, I mean, it may sound arrogant of me to say this, but LeBron, Luka Doncic, guys like that who really read the floor, they understand and can pick apart defenses at any position, those two are ones that stick out the most. Young against Gilgis Alexander. To the middle. And MP with a basket on the assist by Gilgis Alexander. 
MP's gotten four this quarter. The Hawks have gotten only two of six attempts to drop in the fourth. Bogdanovich with a screen on Wiggins. Pass to Young. And last season, a new entity, NBA Africa, created to handle all business on the continent. Brad, you're an investor. Can you talk a little bit about it? Yeah, it's so exciting, B.A. First of all, the game of basketball growing all over the world, and particularly on the continent in Africa. So I think it's not only great from a financial standpoint, but you're creating opportunities for the league, and you're exposing people to Africa to this beautiful game. I think it's a win-win, and I'm so excited. Pass to Bogdanovich. That one's good, and it's Young with the assist. Young's got his fourth assist in this one. I love that Trey Young puts his passes on target and in spots where his teammates are comfortable playing. Gilgis Alexander against Young. Releases from 15. Rebound Atlanta. Collins has got six rebounds in the game. They've shown the power inside. Their rebounding effort has been sensational. And denied. He sends it right off the glass. Pass to Wiggins. The three. Fires in the triple. Wiggins got himself going with a triple. His first basket of the game. The defense decides to gamble off him. And he cashes in. Young with it. Here he goes. That's bucket number five. He's five for 12 now. Doesn't have to get all the way downhill to the rim to be effective because Trey Young has a trademark floater. MP finds Gilgis Alexander. MP against Collins. Back to MP. Inside. The kick out to Wiggins. Right with a steal. And they're on the break. Again, Atlanta. And from the mid-range area, they've been the more effective team. Gilgis Alexander passes to MP. Back to Gilgis Alexander. And he floats it in for the easy two. Credit the sweet setup on that one. And this team's struggles are not his fault. He's putting in work at the offensive end. Young can't hit. His inability to make shots has not brought this team down. That shows you their resourcefulness. Back to MP. Again, Oklahoma City. And that's an opportunistic mid-range shot by MP. Taking what the defense gives him. I love it. Right against Wiggins. Collins, left side. Beyond the arc. The rebound by Wiggins. I've been in this position. Your team is up. You want to drive in the dagger. He may be a little overeager. Gilgis Alexander. And slam dunk by Gilgis Alexander. What? Wait. Hey, dunks are always for the big boys. <laughs> Emphatic move by the point guard. Forget just landed in. He wanted to make a statement. Bogdanovich from long range. He can't get that one to fall. Now Oklahoma City takes it the other way. They'll face the Jazz after this game. That'll be at home. And that's the first of just two home games for him. Wiggins with it. Now Bogdanovich defending. Oh, the block shot grabs it out of the air. What you like about Capella as a shot blocker is the patience. He waits until the shooter commits. Oh, what a nice defensive play to disrupt the lob. MP left side. Pass to Horde. Six on the shot clock. Gilgis Alexander passes to Wiggins. Off target with the three. Atlanta's got just one of six threes to go in the fourth. Octonovich up top, hounded by Wiggins. Here's Young. Here's the ball for the Thunder. At the line for your Hawks, Gorky Dang. 
Yeah, Young Young does shot. everything he can to create for his guys. He's a selfless player who wants everyone to get involved. And he's got a real talent for problem-solving defenses and finding ways to get his guys good looks. Wiggins, right side. Pass to Baisley. Here's Maladon. They need this. And he lays it in. That's a well-timed, well-coordinated play. Comes right off the pick for the lay-in. Outside Young. Outside Herter. Two minutes for minute in the game. Two minutes. Now here's Capella. Pass to Herter. Takes a three. Drills it from deep. Boy, Herter has great shot preparation. Gets excellent rotation on the ball and has the deep range. Back to Maladon. MP, a screen on Young. Maladon attacking. Here's Baisley. It's Wiggins on the wing. Launches a three. Rebounded by the Hawks. Akongwu's got 12 rebounds here tonight. Big time effort. Well, the scoreboard tells you everything you need to know about this one. A great showing here for the Hawks. And it was a big time performance across the board. They looked like they were having fun out there, Graham. <laughs> yeah, B.A., it was almost like watching a cat play with a mouse. I mean, they did pretty much anything they wanted to do out there today. And this win will give them 12 on the year thus far. And against a non-conference opponent, you really want to win the first one. They'll go into the next one knowing how to beat this team for sure. And as most people predicted, the defense, even though they were keying on him, had no answers for Clint Capella. I think his biggest contribution may have been on the boards. He kept plays alive and denied second chances. MP shot is good. Great effort from MP against the contact. He gets past it and is able to sink the shot. Pass to Okongwu. Back to Young. With the teardrop. He got a piece of it. And they'll keep possession. And that one drops for him. And so it's Oklahoma City with it. MP with it. Back to Maladon. It's Wiggins on the wing. MP, a screen on Young. Here's MP. Off the mark. So we see the Hawks taking the W here. Folks, we'd like to thank you for coming out and supporting the team. Please drive home safely, and we hope to see you again at the next event. in the house. What's up, bud? Now, I noticed you looked very confident as you arrived today. How mm -hmm. important to you is how you look when you come to work? Look, man, the best revenge is living well. And I know a lot of these haters out there who want to see me fail, and I need them to see that I'm thriving, you know? It's important that they understand that. Any concern that dressing this way might alienate some of the more blue-collar fans? Oh, no, man. The fans want to see somebody who don't look dirty and wrinkled. We're their heroes, which means you got to look like a boss at all times, especially when I roll up to this arena. You certainly look good today. I appreciate you, Andrew.